You did well, Anakin. He was too dangerous to be kept alive. Yes. But he was an unarmed prisoner. I shouldn't have done that. It's not the Jedi way. It is only natural. He cut off your arm, and you wanted revenge. Sheev Palpatine and Anakin Skywalker, on Count Dooku's death on one occasion, Dooku dueled Yoda on Vijan. Before making a tactical withdrawal, he was able to accomplish the near impossible by wounding his former master. At one point, Dooku fought Skywalker again on Tithe, but the Jedi failed to defeat the Count. Later, Dooku became a part of Sidious's plan to capture Palpatine during the Battle of Coruscant. However, Dooku was unaware that Sidious's true intentions were for Anakin to kill him and replace him as Sidious's apprentice, as Sidious felt it was time for Anakin to be his apprentice, as well as that Dooku no longer served a purpose. Dooku held Chancellor Palpatine captive aboard General Grievous's flagship, the Invisible Hand. When Anakin Skywalker and Obi-Wan Kenobi made their way to the bridge where the Chancellor was being held in an attempt to rescue him, Dooku arrived and confronted the two Jedi, flanked by two super battle droids. He engaged them in a brief, but fierce lightsaber duel. During the duel, Dooku defeated Kenobi, who was incapacitated and knocked unconscious when the Count used the Force to pin Kenobi to the ground with a metal balcony. He then took the opportunity to mock and goad Skywalker, saying that the young Jedi Knight had great fear, hate and anger in him, but was refusing to use them. However, Dooku was soon overpowered by an angered Skywalker, who, with one slash of his lightsaber, severed both the Count's hands at the wrists. Skywalker then caught Dooku's lightsaber out of the air and crossed it with his own blade at the Count's throat. Palpatine praised Anakin, but then betrayed Dooku by telling Anakin to kill him. Shocked and horrified by his master's command, he looked at Sidious, only to be met with a sinister smile from his master. Despite realizing he had been duped by Sidious, he remained silent. Skywalker was initially hesitant to kill Dooku because killing an unarmed prisoner was not the Jedi way. However, when Palpatine ordered Skywalker to kill him, he drew the two lightsabers together, decapitating the leader of the Confederacy, much to his own reluctance.